when the movies were talked about, we were talking about some of the actors like Denzel Washington and some of his fucking movies during that 2003, 2004, 2002 time. And it's always the same fucking actors in all the fucking movies, the same fucking actors. I mean, it's too bad Jack Nicholas wasn't fucking younger. He could start training some of these fucking guys. But I'm just getting to the point where I want to watch some good movies with some new cats. I was hoping Star Trek was going to have a new cast. Instead, it's going to be the same fucking shit. You can't really redo Star Trek. And then what the fuck? Is our, our, is our country going down or what? Superman fucking dies? I'm watching a cartoon and Superman fucking dies. Why? So Spider-Man can start making money? Superman doesn't fucking die. This is a character. Why? You want Christopher Reeve is a fucking actor. Actors die. The original Christopher Reeve. George Reeves, how do you fucking have Superman die in a cartoon? That means you can't make the cartoon anymore. Or what, you're going to go and redo his clone? Horrible. The shit I see on TV. I like Frisky Dingo. It's a good cartoon. I really like Frisky Dingo. One of my favorite. Family Guy is pretty funny, too. It's a little hardcore, though. Um, you got to catch some of that stuff. South Park, I'm not a favorite of South Park. I haven't watched it too much, but those Tourette's ish story was fucking hilarious. It was the funniest shit I have ever seen on TV, and it's how I felt. Let me also talk about the news this week on CNN. I was very happy with the writers of the post all week. The writers this week were good. I wrote, I read most of the stories on all the issues except health. And um, I was really impressed. I liked the writing, and I... I I feel like I slacked off the last few weeks of not being always watching the news because it's the same shit, you know, it's the same fucking shit. You know, today like the Lou Dobbs show, I was watching it from 1 a.m. to 2 a.m. I didn't want the show to end, it was like, let it keep going, it was a fucking awesome show. But that's how I felt, that's how I feel, and Michael cheered off that fucking bald motherfucker sitting there fucking... These guys don't even fucking have IDs. What the fuck? Delaware they're pitching up at 130 bucks. Five years later, there's no IDs in the ports. It's because it's all a scam. It always was a scam. Your whole fear tactic to get people to enlist and then divert them to the other war. Now Turkey's like, you know what? We're going to go down there ourselves in certain areas. Now we're talking about people are starting to share equipment. And I don't want to see WW3 because of our negligence. That's what it looks like. 